good morning everyone welcome back to my channel and welcome to another video today i thought i would film a little sort of day in my life day at online uni kind of vlog because i often get requests to do either more vlogs days in my life at uni that kind of thing so that's exactly what i'm going to be doing today i have just gotten up gotten ready to go to the gym i've got to say online uni is great in that you can organize your lectures when you like them so i've generally been able to get to the gym first thing in the morning which i love because Last year I'd have to sometimes go at like 5, 6 o'clock and I hate that, I'm definitely more of a morning gym person so very happy to just be able to do that so if you get to the gym this morning before then, day of online uni slash work and yeah we'll just see how the day goes. Oh yeah also the other day my advent calendar has already arrived, I know it's basically just the start of November as you're watching this but Livia's have released another one and they always sell out really quickly so I was like I'm gonna have to get one look how like chunky it is this year as well I think it's the biggest one they've done yet I'm very excited for December to start I don't know how I'm gonna get this home when I go back home halfway through November that'll be interest not halfway through November halfway through December that will definitely be interesting but I'm very excited to get started with it just recently made it back in from the gym, also slash Tesco actually, we popped back quickly in the meantime. Went to Tesco to grab some pumpkins as, well actually as you're watching this, it would have already been Halloween. Let me know how it was, what you actually got up to, because I feel like a lot of people have kind of just pushed Halloween aside this year, but yeah. Let me know what you got up to, but we thought we'd grab some pumpkins as it's Wednesday today. This is a few days ago now, and we're like, we need some good ones while they've still got some, so got some pumpkins. I now need to actually get on with uni work, which... I'm not looking forward to it. I'm literally like falling asleep and could have a nap right now. Um, I have also got a little test MCQ, like multiple choice question thing, coming up next week, which counts towards my module mark. So I've been trying to do a revision for that. If you saw my videos last year, you know, anytime I revise, I get out the post it notes, make sort of summarised notes on post its, and then everywhere it ends up covered. I've got through three lectures so far, there's 12 in total. <laughs> and more than half my desk is already covered, so I don't really know. How this is going to go, I mean, I have got this cupboard that I could use for some as well, but I think my whole room is going to end up covered in post-its, or my walls will as well, I don't know. But anyway, I need to get on with that. I literally feel like I could have a nap though right now, so we'll see how this goes. I'm going to do at least like an hour, so it's currently 12, so I'm going to do like a good solid hour at least, then probably have lunch, do a couple more hours, and then also do the lecture that I need to get done today. made it through one more lecture the table is <laughs> basically covered after I get through the next one it's definitely going to be covered because yeah I'm definitely going to run out of space today I think and then tomorrow when it comes to revising I'm going to have to start on the walls but I'm going to head down get some lunch now because I definitely need a break I'm getting hungry as well and then get back into more revision don't know how well you'll be able to see this on camera but it's gone mental outside it's just started absolutely chucking it down. We also still have, I don't know if I've explained this, but we've got a temporary roof because there was a leak in the kitchen roof and yeah, it's hopefully being fixed this Friday though. Hopefully we're finally getting a new roof done. So it sounds even worse on here, but it literally started hailing as well. There was like mini hailstones and oh, it doesn't look as bad anymore, but the wind really picked up. There was leaves going everywhere. It's just gone mental out there right now. Finally got the revision done that I wanted to do. My table is <laughs> officially completely covered, more or less. Actually, there's a tiny bit of space here, but that is like basically half the lecture is pretty much on there now. But I'm happy revision is done because I honestly hate revising so much. I've now got two lectures I'm going to try and get through. It's currently five to four. I don't know. Today's just one of those days that disappeared somehow. You know, those days that just go and you don't really know where they've gone that is today um, so i've got two more lectures although to be fair there's one's 24 minutes and the, the other's 32 minutes so i should be done in like another hour's time i'm hoping and then i just need a nice chill afternoon not afternoon the afternoon will have gone oh i'm so tired i don't even know what i'm saying a nice chill evening after that i feel like today's just one of those days where my energy is just like dipped and Oh, it's been a struggle, but I've woke up a little bit more now. I'm a little bit more focused, so I'm going to try and smash out these lectures and then 
have a nice chill evening, which I do pretty much every evening, but it's even more so needed today. If you haven't yet tried the new Trek bars, where are they? Yeah, I keep them in the freezer like I do with all my chocolate, but if you haven't tried these yet, so they're called the Trek Power Bars. There's the peanut butter flavour and then there's the millionaire shortbread one, which I think is probably my fave. But oh my god, these are amazing. I found them in Tesco. They're a new release of theirs. Love them. I think this is their best product yet. There's like a sort of biscuity base. Then there's like a caramelly layer and then they're covered in nice smooth chocolate. And honestly, they are so, so good. Just had to share them because they're like my new fave find right now. I just thought I'd quickly answer a question as I asked on Instagram. If you're not following me over there yet, then definitely do head over there. I'm very active on there particularly on my stories and I also put posts up daily as well so if you want sort of nutrition and fitness kind of related content that's all backed by science then head over there as I do do daily posts but I did ask if anyone had any questions I thought I'd answer one quickly now before I get into my lectures because I am just in that mood for procrastinating a little bit but one of the ones that I got was how are you finding online uni during the pandemic I can't speak right now how are you finding online uni during a pandemic? And I kind of touched on this briefly earlier, but actually I quite like it. It means that all our lectures are pre-recorded, which means I get to pick and choose as and when I want to do them. So it means I can get to the gym in the morning. Occasionally we have got timetabled stuff that'll be like tutorials and seminars and things that we have to participate in more so they'll be scheduled for a set time but generally most of our lectures and everything we can kind of pick and choose when we do them so I quite like organising my own time it was definitely interesting at first trying to organise when to do all of my lectures and everything as it was all kind of new and I wasn't used to having to do that normally you're given your timetable of when everything's gonna be but now that I've gotten used to it I quite like it, it's comfy, it's cosy being in house, I mean to be fair it's probably not the best place to focus because it's so much easier to be distracted or just start looking at your phone or whatever in between lectures whereas normally when you're just in the lecture place you know you're kind of more focused and in the right area for it. But overall, not gonna lie, I'm actually kind of enjoying online uni, I think it also makes a difference that I'm in the house of people who I know and everything this year as well whereas if I was in uni halls it'd probably be a completely different experience but just being in the house and getting to live with your friends and stuff I feel like it makes it all the better and makes it so much easier as well. I've finally finished all my lectures for the day which I'm very happy about. It was definitely getting to the point where I was struggling to get through the last bit. It is, I don't even know what time it is, it's half six. With the clock change recently, that extra hour shift has really confused me and it feels like it should be a lot later than it is, especially with it now getting dark really early. I've already had to close the curtains. I hate when this starts happening. I hate the early dark evenings. It's just, yeah, it's not for me. It makes me feel like less productive and my day kind of ends sooner and I just want food. Um, but I might, I might even make a midweek roast is kind of what I'm thinking. I'm kind of in the mood for it. I've already got some nut roast pre-made. I've got some in the freezer so I can just defrost that in the microwave and then roast some veg. And yeah, just have a really nice, simple, but kind of cozy, comforting meal on a Wednesday. Cause you know, why not? What is it? Oh my God, in the light? My neck dents really weirdly. Is that normal? This lighting in this room, I'm so sorry, it's awful. Literally, I either look like a ghost or I have weird shadows going across my face. Just realized I never got around to ending this video the other day as I think I just ended up having like a real chill evening and then just, yeah, went to bed basically and completely forgot to even end the video. But I hope you have enjoyed this sort of day in my life vlog style kind of video at uni oh my god yes i have the posters have now expanded to um the table the wall and the cupboard but i finally just got through all my lectures that i needed to revise so that is going to be it that is how my room's going to look for like the next week basically but it's okay i can deal with that um but yeah anyway i hope you have enjoyed this video let me know if you want to see more kind of vlog style videos like this one just sort of days in my life or maybe even a week in my life as well i could film at some point let me know what you want to see also if you have enjoyed it be sure to smash a big thumbs up as well as click on the little red subscribe button down below and also don't forget there's that notifications bell too that you can tap on so you're notified whenever i upload and i'll be sure to see you very soon with a brand new video bye